A group of New Orleans men and women are changing the lives of young men who face violence and other challenges. They're volunteering as mentors, showing the middle school students how they can avoid the tough streets and become community leaders. And as Bill Capo shows us in tonight's Taking a Stand report, one of the mentors, acclaimed chef Leah Chase, gave them an unforgettable experience. It was quite an experience for the eighth graders from McDonough 32 and Fannie Williams schools. They came to Dookie Chase Restaurant for an unforgettable treat, a four-course meal. But this was a dinner with a purpose, the reward for participating in the Silverback Society Mentorship Program. It's designed to change the lives of young men who are too familiar with the violent streets of New Orleans. If you go in that room now and ask them how many of you have somebody that you know that's been killed, probably everybody in there will raise their hand. There's kids that's not getting enough to eat. Uh, there's kids that live in such dangerous situations where you and I couldn't imagine the stress levels. So the Silverback Society is changing the lives of 465 eighth graders from 17 schools, thanks to mentors who volunteered over 4,000 hours to show the students a different path. I tell the children about my life story, and I tell them if I can make it, they can make it. From all of the situations that I have been through, through fate, I, I, I've made it. They've been exposed to men who have, many of whom have, have beat some of the odds that, that they're, they're confronted with, so they know it's possible. It's a working lunch with lessons about life and how to turn hard work into successful careers. The Silverbacks, like, they're changing my life right now because, I mean, I need that. I need the mentoring to do what I got to do to help my family. So and what do you see yourself doing as an adult? Like, I see myself being successful. And there were lessons in restaurant etiquette. And you don't want to be up close and too close to the table where your elbows are on the table, right? The Silverback Society started this program in 2007. Nine years later, the mentors are seeing just how much they've changed the lives of the young men they're helping. We, get, we have kids in college. Uh, these kids are going to be leaders in this community. Stay in school. That is important. And they gave a standing ovation to a legend whose restaurant prepared their meal, Chef Leah Chase. And she gave them advice for life about being successful. Try to do different things, read a lot, and then you'll find your way. But enjoy your young life and just do what you're supposed to do. Stay in school and study. That's your job today. It was a lesson Channing Armour took to heart. You could be anything you want to be. You don't have to have anything to hold you down. If you just keep trying, you can just succeed in life. We show you it can be done. We, sh we show you the benefits of doing it. And, and we prove to you that it's possible. That's hope. That's hope. How cool is this today? I mean, yeah, it's cool. I'm Bill Capo, Eyewitness News, taking a stand. The grants from the Kellogg Foundation and Institute of Mental Hygiene fund the program. And for more information or to become a mentor yourself, you'll find a link on our website at WWLTV.com.